he himself has said, I will never leave you nor forsake you. Hebrews chapter 13 verse 5 What line of thinking do my thoughts take? Do I turn to what God says or to my own fears? Am I simply repeating what God says or am I learning to truly hear Him and then to respond after I have heard what He says? For He Himself has said, I will never leave you nor forsake you. So we may boldly say, The Lord is my helper. I will not fear. What can man do to me? I will never leave you. Not for any reason. Not my sin. Selfishness, stubbornness, nor waywardness. Have I really let God say to me that He will never leave me? If I have not truly heard this assurance of God, then let me listen again. I will never forsake you. Sometimes it is not the difficult of life, but the drudgery of it that makes me think God will forsake me. When there is no major difficulty to overcome, no vision from God, nothing wonderful or beautiful, just the everyday activities of life, do I hear God's assurance even in this? We have the idea that God is going to do some exceptional thing, that He is preparing and equipping us from some extraordinary work in the future. But as we grow in His grace, we find that God is glorifying Himself here and now, at this very moment. If we have God's assurance behind us, the most amazing strength becomes ours. And we learn to sing, glorifying Him, even in the ordinary days and ways of life.